Welcome back to my Let's Play for Pokemon Heart Gold, my Mono Electric run. And it's time to once again take on Snorlax. Yep. Of course, first things first, we need to get our Hanston um, radio here, so we have to look at our expansion card. Um, so, yeah, we're going to be heading to Lavender Town. I did bring along our good friend the Flyer, you know, and a Cutter, so we can. Make our way to Pewter Town afterwards. Um, I do have Max Repels for Diglett's Cave, so I am prepared tonight. Ah, tag team couple, huh? Well, let's see what they got. I ain't got high hopes for them. Um, let's see. Ice Beam. Goodbye, C Dot. I mean, let's face it. You're probably gonna take that Ice Beam very well. Nope, no it didn't. Now it's time for a signal beam. Come on, hero signal in the sky. Well, there goes Low Ted. Ooh, level 51, huh? Ah, light screen. Nah. I mean, light screen's a good move and all, but I got charge that does the same thing effectively when it comes to. Increasing my resistance to special attacks, albeit Livestream can be passed if you get knocked out, I suppose. And then there's the fact, you know, what good is it really? Well, we're having on Billy. Billy the Kid. Ooh, we got through. I thought for sure he was going to turn around as soon as I went by his, behind his back. Like when I was in Sabrina's gym and people constantly catch me, it's like, gosh darn it. You were facing the other way just a second ago. Like, yeah, but now I want to face the other way. Okay, let's go with the charge attack here. Heat wave, huh? Makes me think a bit about G Gundam, actually. When Domon uses a heat end at one point. After catching Sai, um, Saichi. I just mispronounced his name horribly. Ugh, it's been a while since I've watched that show. But yeah, he's fighting um, the power of the Chinese Gundam. And he manages to catch him with this burning, erupting finger, or I'm sorry, God Hand. Not that we could call that in the English translation, because, you know, reasons. Um, yeah. I, I understand the reasoning somewhat, because let's face it, this is a country where... An entire shipment of um, Gundams was refused, you know, the model kits, because the Gundam in question was named um, Death Sight Hell. And they're like, nope, can't take that. It's got hell in the name. It's evil. Take it back. Yeah, that actually happened. So, uh, you gotta really watch that stuff in the U.S., man. Some people just t get, go all crazy with it. Like, one of my co-workers, our former co-workers, used to have a... Their mom was really obsessed with all the whole demon thing and took away all his Pokemon cards. She's like, this stuff is from the devil! And then proceeded to burn them all. I guess he managed to convince her to offer up monetary compensation for it. So I guess he didn't really lose anything. I think he got like a hundred bucks for a bunch of common cards. He's like, I didn't lose much. But I suppose if they're um, misprints or anything, they would have been somewhat valuable. Okay, focus blast. What we got? Uh, not enough. Okay. One more time. Oh, if only get paralyzed. Gosh darn it. Oh, let's just knock it out. Yeah, I know, it has leftovers and stuff, and I could have probably bought some heavy balls or something to catch it, but... You know, whatever. It's not like I would use the leftovers if I had them, so it doesn't really matter. <laughs> not by enough to convince me to... go and catch it, at least. Okay, let's get the Max Repel in the play. That way we can avoid the Diglets. Because I know in some of the games, Diglets have abilities that prevent you from running from battle. Because they're like, you gotta stay and fight me. And I'm like, I don't want to stay and fight you. 
I got better things to do with my time. I mean, seriously. <sighs> okay, let's open her up. Yeah, I want to cut it, all right. Haha, <laughs> goodbye, tree. Well, we reached Pewter City. <laughs> that didn't take too long. I suppose it would depend mostly on um, Snorlax. Um, depending on what I did, it could have dropped um, my starring Pokemon, but I guess I decided to waste this time. I have a few runs with, in, ends with it, so yeah. I knew what its moves were a bit, and it kept giving me some trouble, but I kept having issues um, with the recording as well, so I had to restart like three or four times. It is annoying. That's why I knew how to put the radio um, signal in the right spot to get the Pokeflute channel. Well, that'll do for this episode. Next time, we go up, up against Brock. Until then, see ya.